Alrighty, so hello everybody and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today's video we're out once again looking for ants. And uh, this is a new spot. It's a little bit quieter. I'm now near an old bridge uh, on the side of a highway. <laughs> my parents were out fishing, I just decided. And I might as well go ahead and tag along. See if I can find anything interesting. And it looks like I found something interesting. So pretty much right as we got out of the car, we immediately found, just like Formica Olkai just sitting here, relatively big mound as well. Of course, you know, I like me some Formica Olkai. Of course, I'm not going to disturb the mound because this colony is way too big. I mean, just look at that mound. Absolutely massive. <laughs> Alright, well, that's the first find of today. Um, this is also the place where I first found, uh... Formica Obscura, or Obscure Venture, sorry, and where I collected my first ever colony. So, who knows, maybe we'll end up stumbling across the, uh, that colony as well. So, uh, yeah. Yes? Let's get moving. So, it looks like I've came across the first of probably many Formica Obscure, event, uh, Obscure Ventress colonies. Don't know why it was hard to say. Uh oh, things formed. Yep. <laughs> right where I was kneeing was where their colony was. Ain't that nice? Oh wow, yeah, okay. They're kind of, okay, this is what I mean, hold on, by their mounds being almost invisible. Because I didn't even see that their mound was right here. You can see where they're all swarming. All of a sudden I just felt a bunch of uh, tingles on my leg. You can see a little bit of polymorphism in these workers. Since these are polymorphic species, uh, my colony is doing just fine uh, that I caught recently. But, um... Yeah, so pretty much it looks like their mound goes from, like, where my shadow is, like, right over there, all the way up to, like, somewhere over here. It's a big colony. <laughs> and I bet that as I continue on, I will eventually stumble across a wood nest of them. And then I could be able to catch queens or something else. Oh, yeah, and... There's some Formica species, though. Looks like just Fusca group. Oh no, it's slave makers. Slave making Formica. Right here. You can tell because there's some of uh, these black workers here. And there are some of these red workers as well. This is Obscure Ventress, but <laughs> you get... Yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> The area is literally crawling with Obscure Ventress. <laughs> like, literally all on the ground. If you see those, anything that's moving, that's all Obscure Ventress. And they just go all throughout this area here. The colony is pretty big. Um, this is one of the biggest colonies that I know about, anyways, in my local area. And, uh, yeah, I'm getting swarmed again. Oh my goodness, they're everywhere. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm going to continue sorry, trying to look for some of their nests. Uh, this is like gonna be like the third, <laughs> third episode of this that just involves obscure Ventress. So uh, yeah. Alrighty, so first catch of the day here is gonna be a Leptothorax canadensis colony. This is a one queen colony, at least from what I could see. Uh, let's see if we can find the queen here. A little bit tiny. Yeah, I don't think you can see the queen right now, but there is in fact a queen in here. Uh, it is a relatively small colony of the species. It only had one queen, as far as I know. Found them inside of this piece of wood here. So, uh, yeah, I think I was just called. Hold on a minute. I needed something. Anyways, oh yeah, Leptothorax. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna continue looking on. Uh, finding Leptothorax here is relatively interesting. I haven't caught a colony of them in a very long time. Uh, pretty much since the beginning of the anting season. So, good thing that I caught another colony there. And I will continue looking on, and I will report back if I find anything. Well, I have no idea what I just found, but it looks like I just found a mega nest of, a. Uh, Obscure Ventress. If I flip this, I'm sure I'm going to get sprayed with acid a ton. Oh my goodness. I'm kind of excited to see what's under here. Alright. I guess so. I'll flip it. Look at all those workers, though. Oh my god. Who put this here? Hold on. I gotta clear out this area a little bit. There are so many trees around and a lot of them are bendable so I can at least get 
into a position where I can very easily get this. She needs to get out of the way. All right. Well, got test tubes ready. Here goes nothing. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Here goes nothing. Oh my goodness, it's so buried underground. Hold on. Oh, I need both hands. So, I thought there was a hole that goes under it. There isn't. This, this colony is literally nesting inside of this big red metal thing. Like, look at that. They've just been stuffing this filled with just... Wow! Yeah, that's all up in there. It's just thatch. Wow. That is definitely something. So this is just gonna be here forever, I guess. This is just their colony. Just all up in here, it's heavy too. Wow. All right, that's an insane find. Reminder, I'm out in the forest currently. It's just this random piece of wood here. I guess this is the big main colony. All right, well, that's an interesting find. I guess I'll continue onwards with my search for some cooler ants. I've still not caught another ant colony so far. That's all right. All right, I'll report back if I find anything else cool. Genuinely, at this point, it's not even worthy news. I found another big old nest of Obscure Ventress. I'm like stepping on it now. There's like everywhere here. There's their mound, their proper mound. They kind of nest all along this tree. But here's the mound that they're actually nesting in. As you can see, they're going a little crazy. This species is wild. <laughs> and this, this is all one colony, by the way, that I'm finding. This isn't just like several larger colonies sort of in like one big spot. This is one huge colony. And you can see there's even more on the ground here. So, yeah. It's a little insane as to see how much because pretty much from there, way back there, we're gonna keep on walking. There's probably nests all across this area here that are just in the brush. But to keep on walking, I'm, I'm, there's still, you know, this is still all their territory. Still going. Still going. Still going. Still going. Here's their other big nest in the other end. Right here. And it continues from that big nest all the way over here. Continues. You'll see workers for once in a while if you stop and stare at the ground for long enough. To in here. And it probably continues onward there. Somewhere. So yeah. It's a big colony. So upon switching locations, found a nice sized colony for my little guy. Just chilling out. Legs getting covered in just tons and tons of uh those annoying things called mosquitoes. Oh, flew away. Ah. Yeah. Pretty interesting. Far away from that one, we have this one. Which I'm guessing is also old guy. We'll see. I don't know. This is actually Formica. Just normal Formica. Subtricia group. Or Fosca group. I don't know. Oh. Can you see? No, you can't really. I'm getting swarmed. Turtle! Snapper! 
That's its head, it looks like, from what I'm zooming in. Mm -hmm. Cute little thing. It's first herp all day, even though I've been looking for them actively. He's just chilling there. I know I can't catch it because they swim fast. And it's in the water, so I don't feel like getting wet. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Even more of what I think is Formica Obscura Ventris. I swear wherever I go, I cannot escape them. It is getting extremely annoying. <laughs> they are all I am finding. Yeah. Well, maybe I can get a colony out of this one too. Who knows? <sighs> Car. Um, found another nest of these guys. Again. Uh. I don't want another episode just to be Obscure Ventress, but it looks like, once again, for a third time in a row, they are the main stars. Because they're all I'm finding. It's getting a little annoying, but it's cool just seeing how just everywhere the species is. It's absolutely insane. I think they're probably one of the most common ants up here then. I rarely ever go anywhere else except for where I've been before, and now I'm here somewhere else. They're just kind of everywhere. Well. Oh, 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 I'm stepping on a nest, and I, oh my goodness, their nest is way bigger than what I thought. Okay, so it starts over there, goes over there. It's a big, wide nest. Alright. It's time to get rock flipping and trying to find queens. So upon flipping, two rocks. Look at all that elate brood. They're definitely getting prepared for flights. There are no queens. But, wow. That is insane. That is very insane. It's a lot of elate brood. So I know one colony I found literally had elates. So maybe this colony is a little bit late on that, but, I mean, wow. That's awesome. Well, I guess I'll continue looking for queens. I'm surrounded. That's great. Found a wood nest of them, though. But, uh, under all these rocks, there is just tons of them. And the more I step, the more I kill, which causes a bigger and bigger want of them, or a bigger bigger of them wanting to kill me. So I'm just gonna sort of step up here, brush them off of my legs, but they are, they're everywhere. <laughs> so, um, every rock is just covered in them now. You know, when I say every rock, including my rock that I'm standing on, they kind of own everything here. Over there. They're audible, by the way. You can't pick hear it, but, uh, I sure can. <laughs> Well, that video ended rather suddenly. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, pretty much Obscure Ventures is all I've been finding recently, and uh, I really wanted to get out a new video for you guys. So, you know, this is the, the video that you got, I guess. So, if you enjoyed it, and, you know, like the video if you liked it, dislike if you dislike it, subscribe if you're new, uh, Patreon, Instagram, Discord, all that fun stuff in the description, and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.